So I just discovered that F9 does something in this game. And if it's quick load, I'm gonna fucking pee my pants. That's weird. Okay. Um, so it is quick load. Which is prohibitive. There we go. Uh, not that door. The whole station is crawling with mechs. I'm doing the best I can. Keep on keeping on. By the way, today's episode is sponsored in part by robots. We think they're evil, but we keep making them. station on the wall. Hopefully there's enough to get him up and moving again. Grab the metagel from the first aid station on the wall. Uh, where's metagel? Mass over your unity power. And then use unity. Perfect. Yeah. I thought maybe I could shut down the security mechs. But whoever did this fried the whole system. Completely irreversible. Uh -oh. That's what you were doing. Why do you even have security mech clearance? You were in the bio league. Weren't you listening? I came here to try and fix this. Besides, I was shot. How do you explain that? I don't trust any of you yet. Let's get someplace safe and then we'll sort out whose fault it is. Right, Shepard. We need to find Miranda. Can't leave her behind. Why is that? Forget about Miranda. She was over a D wing. The mechs were all over that sector. There's no way she survived. A bunch of mechs won't drop Miranda. She's alive. Okay. Then where is she? Why haven't we heard from her? There are only two possible explanations. She's either dead or she's a traitor. Then why did she wake me up and warn me about the attack? Okay. Maybe she's not a traitor. But that doesn't change the facts. We're here, she's not. We need to save ourselves. Yeah, but you know. Is only a few. Oh, jeez. The canisters to clear a path to the shuttles. Sure. It really isn't the time, Jacob. You won't make it if she's expecting a shot in the back. If you want to piss off the boss, it's your ass, Jacob. The Lazarus Project, the program that rebuilt you. It's funded and controlled by Cerberus. That sounds familiar. I ran into Cerberus a few times while I was investigating Saren. Some kind of pro-human splinter group, right? Well, that's what the Alliance wants people to believe. There's more to it. The Alliance declared you dead. They gave up. Cerberus spent a fortune to bring you back. Look, I'd be suspicious too, but right now we have to work together. I thought you deserved to know what's what. Once we're off the station, I'll take you to the elusive man. He'll explain everything. He sounds Alliance. pretty elusive. Fine. Well, if I won't get any more answers here, let's get moving. It's not much farther to the shuttle bay. That's just lovely, actually. I'm feeling it, and I'm like, 
Yeah, my shots are connecting. This is a good time. What's shooting at me? Oh. Oops. What it what are we doing? I don't know what I was supposed to do there. Oh, okay, so we're trying to... Trying to make a picture that's similar to that one. Well, this feels kind of dumb. Perfect. This is a weird hacking minigame. Oh well. I love that they spend a trillion billion dollars bringing me back to life and like all I'm useful for is going the wrong way sometimes. <laughs> they, they, they're like, Shepard, it's this way. And I'm like, which way? Shepard, you are most expensive asset. How are you this dumb? Oh, is this what I'm supposed to be doing? Whoops. How'd that happen? Where am I supposed to be going? Oh, you can vault in this one, I forgot. Never mind. I'm not gonna vault over there. Oh, hey, here we go. This Come door. On. Through here. We're almost at the. Miranda, but you are. You must be Ramanda. Ramanda? If you say so. What's our next step? We get on the shuttle and go. My boss wants to speak to you. You mean the elusive man? I know you work for Cerberus. Ah, Jacob. I should have known your conscience would get the better of you. Ah, well. The commander isn't the way to get her to join our cause. Well, since we're getting everything out in the open, is there anything else you want to ask before we go, Commander? Uh... What about the rest of the people on the station? This is the evac area. If they're not here now, they're not coming. I've heard right. this station to last a lifetime. Or two, in your case. Come on. Good one. Uh, the lifetime... Two lifetimes joke, that was funny. Before you meet 
with the elusive man, we need to ask a few questions to evaluate your condition. Okay, go ahead. Miranda, more tests? Shepard took down those mechs without any trouble. That has to be good enough. It's been two years since the attack. The elusive man needs to know that Shepard's personality and memories are intact. Ask the questions. Two years? Two years? Gone that long? Two years and twelve days. And you were on an operating table for most of it. The sooner we start, the sooner we can be done. Start with personal history. Okay. Records show you grew up on Earth. Tough environment, no parents. You enlisted when you survived the Thresher Maw attack that wiped out the rest of your team. Do you remember that? Uh, it was painful. A lot of friends that day. Going through something like that changes you. It can break you if you let it. I read the report. Fifty Marines died in the coups. You were the only one who lived. Satisfied, Miranda? Almost. Let's try something more recent. All right. Vermeer, where you destroyed Saren's cloning facility. You had to leave one of your squad behind to die in the blast. Yep. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams was killed in action. It was your call. Why did you leave her behind? Being in command means that sometimes you give orders knowing that your people are going to die. It can't affect your decisions. Ash gave her life for the rest of the team. Without her, I couldn't have stopped Saren. She died a hero. I understand, Commander. And I wasn't judging your decision. Everybody at Cerberus knows that cloning facility had to be destroyed. Shepard, think back to the Citadel. After the Council died on the Destiny Ascension and you killed Saren. What happened next? Anderson led a new Council. When the Council dead, humanity stepped into power. We formed a new Council. I recommended Captain Anderson to lead it. Yes, Captain Anderson is now Councilor Anderson. Though from what I hear, he preferred life in the military. Still. Good to know that the human council member isn't going to put politics ahead of defense. Your memory seems solid. There are other tests we really should run. Let's run them. Oh, Miranda. Enough with the quizzes. No, I'm alright. Memories are there, and I can vouch for Shepard's combat skills personally. I suppose you're right. We'll have to hope the elusive man accepts our little field test as evidence enough. Let's hope so. Because I ain't doing nothing up. Where's my ship, by the way? Do you guys just get rid of my ship? Like, I realize it got blown up, but if you can bring me back to life. I'm pretty sure you can, you know, bring your fucking boat back to life. I don't want to talk to Jacob yet. Ah, a hologram. Am I a hologram or is he a hologram? Who's a gram? Oh, I'm the hologram. Shit, uh, here we go. I knew it. Hey, I'm a hologram. Ain't that neat? I thought we'd be meeting face to face. Unnecessary precaution. Not unusual for people who know what you and I know. Are you Willem Dafoe? What exactly is it that you and I know? You sound like Willem Dafoe. The universe is more fragile than we'd like to think. David Cage, is that you? You missed your mouth there, buddy. That one woman, one very specific woman, might be all that stands between humanity and the greatest threat of our brief existence. The Reapers. Good to see your memory still intact. How are you feeling? Skip the That's pleasantries, the dud. What are the Reapers doing that made you decide to bring me back? We're at war. No one wants to admit it, but humanity is under attack. While you've been sleeping, entire colonies have been disappearing. Human colonies. We believe it's someone working for the Reapers. Just a Saren and yet they did sovereign. You've seen it yourself. You've bested all of them. That's just one reason we chose you. You could have trained an entire army for what you spent to bring me back. You're unique. Not just in ability or what you experienced, but in what you represent. Oh you shucks. In a key moment. Secret moment romance you're space a racist. And I don't know if the weakness understand fear, but you killed one. They have to respect that. Where do we start? The Reapers just point me in the right direction. Miranda was worried you'd be resistant. She's not usually wrong. Well, she was this time. I have a shuttle ready to take you to Freedom's Progress, the latest colony to be abducted. 
Miranda and Jacob will brief you. I'm supposed Miranda to trust him? Wilson in cold blood. Jacob's just a gun for hire. Expect me to trust them? Wilson was one of my best agents, but he was a traitor. Miranda did exactly what I expected of her, and she saved your life in more ways than one. Jacob's a soldier, one of the best. He's never fully trusted me, but he's always been honest about it. You'll be just fine with them. Do I have a choice? Is this a volunteer job, or am I being volunteered? You always have a choice, Shepard. If you don't find the evidence we're both looking for, we can part ways. But first, go to Freedom's Progress. Find any clues you can. Who's abducting the colonists? Do they have any connection to the Reapers? I brought you back. It's up to you to do the rest. Alright, fair fucks. She's gonna fucking hang up on me like that? Alright, I see. Ooh. Oh, I like that. That's not quite as nice. This one's cool. Armor. Cerberus assault armor. Ooh. This is all quite good, but I prefer the N7 armor, to be frank. Kachoo! Kapow! Kachoo! Pew! Kasplosh! Nah, no helmet, please. Glowing shoulders, shoulder guards, you know it. I'm just making this as glowy as possible. Material, tint one. Do I have any tints? Ooh, I can be white or like pink, red. I think I prefer just the dark gray actually, thinking about it. Ooh, but accented. We gotta go with red. And the pattern. Yeah, alright, that's fair. Cool. the elusive man convinced you to join us, Commander. I just agreed to work with him. I still don't trust him. Do you trust me, Commander? I'm not sure. I haven't made up my mind about you yet. At least you're giving me a chance. Most Alliance soldiers hate Cerberus on principle. Goodbye. That's all for now. Yes, ma'am. Oh, is this the end of the... Okay. Is this what's happening now? Or are they just showing me this as like some fucking nonsense garbage? We should be there shortly, Shepard. The elusive man put us under your command. Do you have any orders? Our first priority is to look for survivors. That's unlikely, Commander. No one was left at the other colonies. They were completely deserted. Fuck, never mind. To find somebody. Anything's better than another ghost town. Shit, so do we just never get the Normandy back then? That sucks. Uh-oh. When did I turn black? Oh, never mind. We're all back to normal. Except for you. Haha! <laughs> joke! Anyway. These are the kind of jokes you can't make when there aren't lighting glitches. Yep. 
It's weird. Yeah, well, at least they went peacefully, you know? That's guns. Someone's texting me. Someone reprogrammed them to attack on site. We're not alone here. We're not alone here. Stop being Australian. This is space, alright? You don't have to. Yes? Okay. Don't need either of those. Oh wait, whoops. Hey! Stop right there! Prata, you said you'd let me handle this. Dally! Shepherd? I'm not taking any chances with Cerberus operatives. Put those weapons down! Hey Dally! Shepherd? Is that you're alive? It's me. They rebuilt me, Tally. In return they asked me to investigate these attacks on human colonies. You'll pardon us for not taking you at your word, Cerberus. We're well within our rights to investigate attacks on a human colony. I'd like to know what the Quarians are doing here. Weapons down, Praza. Whatever's going on here, I don't think we need another fight. One of our people was here on pilgrimage. His name was Vitor. We came to find him. Why was he here? Isn't that a little strange? A Quarian visiting a remote human colony? Quarians can choose where they go on pilgrimage. Vitor liked the idea of helping a small settlement. He was always nervous in crowds. That's he fair. That he was unstable. Combine that with damage to his suit CO2 scrubbers and an infection from an open-air exposure, and he's likely delirious. When he saw us landing, he hid in a warehouse on the far side of town. We suspect he also programmed the mechs to attack anything that moved. Vitor is the only one who can tell us what happened here. We should work together to find him. Good idea. You'll need two teams to get past the drones anyway. Now we're working with Cerberus? No. Praza, you're working for me. If you can't follow orders, go wait on the ship. Head for the warehouse through the center of the colony. We'll circle around the far side and draw off some of the drones to clear you a path. Make sure to keep in radio contact. Will do. Good luck, Shepard. See you on the far side. Got it. Got it. Oh yeah. We'll take care Can I still move? Yeah, I can. That's a cool little power. It's like some kind of Oh. Thought that was an enemy. Turned out it was not. Use overload on Neat, some more ammo. Oh, fuck. What is that? What are, what are they targeting? Door is locked. Well, that's good to know. Oh, wait, is he invisible? Use another overload. Where is he?
There's nothing there. Oops. Sorry, guys. Like, I'm not... I'm not seeing anything. Is that it? No, that's a light. You guys need to chill out. What are you shooting at, guys? Come on. That's my quick save button. Hold on. F5. Okay. It's gonna be a pretty disruptive button if it's gonna be F9 for the rest of the game. But, oh well. I guess I can get past that. That being said, a little bit difficult when it stops recording every time you quick load in. I'll probably just change it eventually. That's better. It's every second time I've found, so... Jesus. left shift to display direction of current object. Oh, hey. Look at that. Yeah, I'll take a rocket directly. Who cares? I'm Shepard. Been through hell and back. I've been to space without a spacesuit. Oh, so it's like one and two. Well, duh. What did you expect? Also, sorry to hear that, actually, thinking about it. Son of a bitch to take down. Gee, thanks. Overload, take out some shields. Just give it a couple of shots. This may not be the best idea, thinking about it. What other gun? Oh, I have several guns. Heavy pistol, grenade launcher, sniper rifle. Okay. I mean, if you're just gonna stand there, then uh, this will be pretty easy. Great work, everyone.
good. I'm glad. All right, what's good, dude? No veto, not here. Swarms can't find. Monsters coming. I have to hide. Nobody's going to hurt you anymore. I don't think he can hear you, Commander. Have to hide. Have to hide. Mechs will protect. Swarms coming. Storm coming. Storm. <laughs> Human? Where did you hide? How come they didn't find you? Who didn't find us? The... the monsters. The swarms. They took everyone. We weren't here, dude. We're not survivors, Vitor. We just got here. You don't know. You didn't see. But I see everything. Looks like security footage. He must have pasted together manually. What the hell is that? My god. I think it's a collector. What's a collector? Is that some kind of alien? There are species from somewhere. Is that some kind of alien? Come on, Shepard. Everything in this fucking universe is some kind of alien, you dumb. They usually work through intermediaries, uh -huh. flavors, or hired mercenaries. If they're involved with the Reapers somehow, it could explain what happened to the colonies. The collectors have advanced technology. They could have a weapon that disables an entire settlement at once. Yikes. The Seeker swarms. No one can hide. The Seekers find you. Freeze you. Then the monsters take you away. What happened next? The monsters took the people onto the ship, and then they left. The ship flew away, but they'll be back from the... No one escapes. Nah. I think that's probably all we're getting out of him, Commander. I appreciate what you told us. You were very helpful. I studied them. The monsters. The swarms. I recorded them with my Omni tool. Lots of readings. Electromagnetic. Dark energy. We need to get this data to the elusive man. Grab the quarry and call the shuttle to come pick us up. What? Vitor is injured. He needs treatment, not an interrogation. You heard that? You heard him. Just need to see if he knows anything else. He'll be returned unharmed. Your people tried to betray us once already. If we give him to you, we'll never get the intel we need. Mm. Raza was an idiot, and he and his men paid for it. You're welcome to take Vitor's Omnitool data, but please, just let me take him. Vitor goes with Tally. He's traumatized, and he needs medical care. Tally will give us the Omnitool data and take him to the flotilla. Understood, Commander. Thank you, Shepard. I'm glad you're still the one giving the orders. I'm glad but to see you. There, if I find anything that can help you, I'll let you know. Okay. We're ready for pickup. Shepard, good work on Freedom's progress. Thanks. The Quarians forwarded their findings from Bedor's debriefing. No new data, but it's a surprising olive branch given our history. Yep. You and I have different methods, but I can't argue with your results. You ever think about playing nice once in a while? Diplomacy is great when it works, but difficult when everyone already perceives you as a threat. Mm. But more importantly, you confirm the Collectors are behind the abductions. Why do I get the feeling you knew about them already? I had my suspicions, but I needed proof. The Collectors are enigmatic at best. They periodically travel to the Terminus systems, looking to gather seemingly unimportant items or specimens, usually in exchange for their technology. When their transactions are complete, they disappear as quickly as they arrive, back beyond the unmapped Omega-4 relay. Until now, we've had no evidence of direct aggression by the Collectors. The Collectors are definitely a human enemy, but how do we know there's a connection to the Reapers? 
Their focus shifted to humanity only after you and the human fleet destroyed Sovereign. The abductions are related, even if the Alliance and the Council refuse to believe it. I won't wait until the Reapers are on the march. We need to take the fight to them. If this is a war, I'll need an army, or a really good team. I've already compiled a list of soldiers, scientists, and mercenaries. You'll get dossiers on the best of them. Nah, I want my team back. Convincing them to work with you could be challenging, but you're a natural leader. I'll I kind of just want my team back. When they make their next appearance, I'll notify you and your team. Be ready. Keep your list. I want people I trust. The ones who helped me stop Saren and the Geth. That was two years ago, Commander. Most of them have moved on. Or their allegiances have changed. Laria? Where's Liara Tassani? She's on Ilium. My sources say that she's working for the Shadow Broker. If so, she can't be trusted. Uh. Tally. But Tally. She already helped us on Freedom's Progress. That was unexpected. I need more intel before I commit. Okay, I get it. They're not available. You're a leader, Shepard. You'll get who you need. I'm still a Spectre. Maybe I can get the council to help us out. If you think you could convince them, by all means. Just remember, you've been gone a long time. Things have changed. You worry about the collectors. I'll make sure my team's ready. Good. Two things before you go. Yeah? First, head to Omega and find Morton Solis. He's a brilliant Solarian scientist. Our intelligence suggests he may know how to counteract the Collector's paralyzing Seeker Swarms. So I order? I haven't even started and you're telling me what to do? I'm giving you direction. What you do with it is up to you. I'm sure you'll have to know this. Alright. What's the other thing? I found a pilot I think you might like. I hear he's one of the best. Someone you can trust. The Joker? Well, he can walk, so it's definitely not Joker. Hey, Commander. Oh. Just like old times, huh? I can't believe it's you, Joker. Look who's I didn't believe it was you. <laughs> Got lucky. A lot of strings attached. How'd you get here? It all fell apart without you, Commander. Everything you stirred up, the Council just wanted it gone. The team was broken up, record sealed, and I was grounded. The Alliance took away the one thing that mattered to me. Hell yeah, I joined Cerberus. You really trust the elusive man? Well, I don't trust anyone who makes more than I do. But they aren't all bad. Saved your life. Let me fly. And there's this. Ooh. Told me last night. What is? Is that? Ooh, new paint job. That's nice. SR two. That's because the other one was SR one. Ooh, that's nice. I like that. Hello. Got that new chrome finish. The other one, I didn't like those matte tiles we had on the outside the ooh ooh that's nice okay where does it say normandy though is my question it's good to be home huh commander i guess we'll have to give her a name da 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 I can't remember when I last split up this episode. Oh well. Nice. Alright, I think this is going to be the end of this episode. Just make sure nothing important happens after this loading screen and I think we'll be done. Well, we got this walking cutscene. My brand new outfit too, that's nice. Ah, just like old times. Y'all weren't here, but this is a nice ship. Runs good. It's got legs like nobody's business, I'll tell you that. 
Get it, cause she, cause she runs good. Welcome aboard the new Normandy, Commander. Normandy, Normandy two. I've been looking over the dossiers. I'd strongly recommend starting by acquiring Morden Solus, the Solarian professor on Omega. We know the collectors use some type of advanced technology to immobilize their victims. We'll need him to develop a countermeasure to protect us. Good point. Without that countermeasure, we'll be helpless if we ever run into the collectors. Acquiring Professor Solus seems like the most logical place to start. Who's that? Are you. I'm Normandy's artificial intelligence. Mm. The crew like to refer to me as Edie. Almsmen aren't happy when someone takes control of a ship away from them. Especially Joker. I do not helm the ship. Mr. Morrow's talents will not go to waste. During combat, I operate the electronic warfare and cyber warfare suites. Beyond that, I cannot interface with the ship's systems. Okay. I observe and offer analysis and advice. Nothing more. Anyone else I should meet? I'm guessing it takes more than just the three of us plus Joker to fly this ship. The Normandy has a full crew. They're at their stations awaiting your orders. Good. Final preparations for takeoff are complete, Commander. When you're ready to go, just pick a destination from the galaxy map and the CIC and I'll plot a course. Perfect. Jacob and I should return to our posts. Come find us if you have any questions. Alright. Yeah, you too, buddy. All right. Jesus, that's a lot of things. Welcome aboard, Commander. This is nice and new. All right. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Remember to uh, remember to tip your waitresses, and I'll see you all in the next one.